what's going on guys? So today I have another wallet review for you. This was sent to me by a company, KH Leather or KNH Leather. I don't know if there's an and in there. Uh, I found him on Instagram. Uh, I was scrolling through different leather pages and wallet pages and I came across his channel or his page, I mean. And I thought the designs of the wallets were really fascinating and I liked the colors and I liked the design of the wallet. So I hit him up and he gladly sent me a wallet for a review. So big shout out to KH Leather. Really appreciate it, man. I talked to the owner and he's a really, really nice guy. Um, so this is the five pocket design wallet. It has one pocket here for a card, one slot here. It has a spot in the middle for cash. Uh, let me see if we'll focus there. Uh, or, or, or that's what I use it for at least, but you can probably put another card in there. And then one more spot here for a card and one more spot here. So there's plenty of room for anything you need. Uh, if you are a person who uses a slim wallet, this is definitely a really, really good option. So there it is focused there. Let me get it in the right light and you can see that KH leather logo there etched into the, or uh, pressed into the leather. So really, really nice. Uh, the stitching is really good. I asked for uh, the brown with the red color combo because I really, really like that color combination. And the leather that he uses, this is Horween leather. It's uh, English tan horse front. I don't really know what that means. I, I It might come from a horse. I don't know. Um, but uh, yeah, that's the, uh, that's the leather he said that it was just in case you guys wanted to know. Uh, the leather is so freaking smooth. I can't describe to you how smooth this leather is. Uh, it, it's just incredibly smooth. I like how you can see almost the veins from the cowhide. And that just shows you how high quality uh, this leather is. Uh, it already has uh, a few scratches uh, and, um, and even some patina. Uh, this is about a week's worth of use. Uh, I usually, uh, if I get sent a wallet, I usually use it for about a week. Um, and then I do a review on it because it's just, it's really hard for me to get to a lot of wallets. Uh, I have a lot of wallets that I review. Um, so I usually use each wallet for about a week or two and then I do a review on it. So this is about a week's worth of use. Uh, and you can already see where it's, uh, you know, where the card is kind of scratched in the leather there. There's a couple uh, fingernail nicks. As you can see, it scratches really easily. Um, but if you give it a little rub, it usually doles it out and comes out. And uh, but I like the scratches. It just shows, uh, it gives the wall a little bit of uh, character. Um, so I like that a lot. Um, and this thing smells amazing. The, obviously, it's it's gonna smell good. It's super super high quality leather. Well, there's not really a backside, but this is the backside I think because on the front side it has that KH logo. So here's the backside. It's a little bit darker on the backside as you can see. So that's the front side, and then that's the backside. So it's a little bit darker back here. Um, yeah, but I just really like the thread. The burnishing is really really good as you can see on the uh, edges here. The edge burnishing is awesome. Uh, it's a super thin wallet. Keeps a really really slim profile. Uh, it's going to be really good if you are a minimalist, so this wallet will work perfect for you. Uh, in the middle, I have a business card, uh, but if you fold up a couple bills, it makes it a little bit more bulky, but not nearly as bulky as like a bifold or anything like that. This is a super, super thin wallet. Uh, the leather is actually pretty thin too. It's not as thick as I thought it would be, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. As long as the leather holds up, that's all that matters. I'm just going to slowly go around here and just show you the wallet and um, show you everything about it. Show you the corners, uh, the patina already up there. I really like the patina. And then I'll show you the uh, the leather from the inside of the wallet. So that's the leather on the inside there. Sorry, I don't know if you can really see it, but it's a little bit more rough than the stuff on the, uh, that's on the outside. So you can tell he uh, the wallet or the leather on the outside is uh, polished and cleaned up a little bit. So, yeah. That's going to do it. I just want to do a quick little review of this wallet. Um, really, really nice of him to send this along for a review. I would definitely be using this in the future. Uh, but like I said, I just test out a lot of wallets. But this is definitely one of my favorite wallets I've ever gotten. It's just super high quality. Um, and I really enjoy uh, using it. So a big thank you to KH Leather. I will link his Instagram. Please go buy something from him. As you can see here, the quality is amazing. Uh, but that's going to do it. Thank you guys for watching. And I will see you in the next video. Zisbevid signing out. Peace.